Do you know you can actually auto cut your video using Adobe Premiere Pro 2024 version? Yes, recently Adobe has introduced Adobe Premiere Pro 2024 version and there they have added some updates. And today we're going to learn how you can auto cut your videos using Adobe Premiere Pro. Inside Adobe Premiere Pro, I have already inputted the clip that I want to test today, right? If I just play it back, you'll see here is the clip. Hey guys, this is James and welcome to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm going, you can clearly see I have made some intentional pauses here to test the video, right? If I go here on the audio section, you can see here is a pause, here is a pause. So to make a new sequence, I will just click and drag it here on the timeline section. It will make a new copy, right? If I want to manually cut the video, what I need to do, I have to go here. Then I have to put my playhead here. Then I have to press Q to cut this section. Again here, I'll just make a cut here. Then again here, I'll just press Q to cut this section again right so if the clip is too long then it will kill a lot of time when you edit the video right so there are some plugins that you can use to auto cut the video one plugin name is AutoCut, so you can use AutoCut plugin to do this thing but from today you don't need to use any third party plugin you can actually use adobe premiere pro net picture which is text space editing to auto cut your video so first what you need to do if you're using Adobe Premiere Pro 2024 version, then you can select the video. Then you have to go here, window, then select text panel, right? This is the text panel. If you are not using Adobe Premiere Pro 2024 version, you will not going to see this feature. So make sure you have upgraded Adobe Premiere Pro. So select the video, then you can press transcribe to transcribe this clip. It will automatically transcribe the clip and make sure the video language is supported by Adobe. So here is the transcription, right? So if I want to delete this pauses, what I need to do, I can go here and then I can right click, then I can click on cut or extract, right? It will cut this portion. But there is a feature that Adobe has introduced, which is if you go here on the filter section, you can filter out different words. You can filter out pauses. So I'll just select pauses. It will automatically select the pauses, right? So if I go here on the pauses section, then you'll see there is a button called delete, right? If I just press on delete button, then you'll see there are several options. One is delete all and other one is delete. If you want to delete the pauses one by one, then you can just click on delete, then the, it will delete this section. But I want to delete all the pauses. So what I need to do, I have to click on delete all. It will automatically delete all the pauses that is highlighted, right? So if I just play it back now, today I'm going to show you the new features that Adobe has introduced recently on their Adobe Premiere Pro 2024 edition. So Can without you... wasting any more time, let's get started. Shall Adobe? we? We can automatically delete the pauses using Adobe Premiere Pro, right? So what is your opinion? Let me know in the comment section below. So that is all for today. I hope you have liked this video. If you have liked this video and learned something new from this one, then you can give me a thumbs up and if you this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing then you can subscribe to this channel to get more awesome videos just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one and then goodbye